Welcome to OCG World. Please like, share and subscribe. Just heard some bad news today about the Bollywood actor Sushan who's uh, had depression and he's uh, killed himself. Um, very tragic news, you know, not just to the Bollywood world but to the whole world because apparently as men we don't tend to, you know, speak about depression to into anyone you know we like to keep it in in ourselves because we you know because we're men you know we don't like to share our you know you know them kind of problems um so I, i've been saying it for the past few months that i'm gonna make a video i did make one um but just deleted it um not because of shame or anything like that I, you know i guess it's that time in it you know where you feel like you know what i can do it but i just didn't and um, so this is my video now this is about me against depression um it's a hard topic to talk about um like they say you know it's hard to talk to people about this you know because there's always someone that's gonna look at them and, wow personally i guess no one really you know whoever's gonna be watching this probably most of you probably won't even know who i am um but uh the ones that do know obviously you know that i used to be fine you know walking talking everything out and about chill this and that but you know it's been a long time now since i've gone kind of say gone undercover you know just due to my disability that i've got you know um limb girdle muscular muscular dystrophy um just the weakness of the muscles so at the moment i am like kind of on a wheelchair now um, so you can understand why I actually had depression, you know. Um, even I know people that are going through depression, but they just simply deny it. And no, 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 I'm fine, I'm fine. And do you know what? You can clearly see it, you know. And it, I think it maybe might be in the Asian community where you don't really want to talk about it. You don't want to share your problems. I don't know but you know me I would say just uh, before the lockdown I think probably a month before I kind of woke up basically and I just thought what am I doing you know this ain't me you know because I've probably had depression for, I don't know I can't even tell you how long for probably about seven eight months before and like same thing no i'm fine i'm fine you know nothing wrong with me and uh you know whenever like the missus and the kids are gonna go out and just tell me yes no no you're not going there you know just make any excuse just to be you know basically have my own space just wanted to be lonely just wanted to be like um alone do my own things you know but for me it was like the new norm so basically yeah, you lot got a chance to go, please go out, go out, go out. I just want to be alone. And like they said, TV used to be my best mate, you know. Um, just me and the TV and just like like I said, you feel like lazy. You kind of get used to it. So for you, it's like, it's like, yeah, it's fine, you know. But no one really understood what was I going through, you know. Just fighting on little, little things and just sleepless nights believe me it used to be really hard you know like just not going to sleep during the night just stay up all night or twisting turning twisting turning this way that way and so it's time to get up it was hard you know well now i'm thinking about I'm thinking you know why but the thing with me is i'm a strong person meaning i know i can get through anything you know is i think is that will i've got that willpower inside me that thinks you know what i can do it i can do it you know i think that's what put me through everything you know even like i got help off my wife my kids that's i think without them i don't i personally don't think what would have happened with me you know, I personally never thought about, you know, hanging myself or killing myself. No, 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 no. I, I, I couldn't. You know, every time I looked at my wife and kids, I thought, right, you know, I'm, I, they need me more than I need them. 
you know so i would never think about anything like that but it was just about being lonely just be myself do nothing you know i don't personally know what to say because it's hard you know oh, people have gone through depression they know you know what they went through you know the ones that have come out are very good um but i guess you need positive energy around you i think that's the main thing keep yourself busy you know there's no point thinking yeah okay we got depression or you don't think you got depression but you think yeah 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 whatever because you see a lot of people you know killing themselves on all sorts and because no one understands what they're going through you know especially like people taking the mickey out of them and all sorts you know and it's hard i think it's hard with anything any problem you have in life it's hard because you get labeled don't you and even when the people are talking about it or whatever you know people label them but i think do you know what if you're strong inside you can do anything that's what i would say you can do anything that's the main thing but like i say you need the right people around you there's loads of support no matter where you are in the country you you should have support no matter what because it's a big thing you know and like i said with me it's like i had my family with me like me my wife and kids and all that and like i said just before the lockdown I, you know i did just only wake up like not wake up as in i just got up fresh and i just thought what am i doing you know i've got you know i've got to start doing and suddenly i've just come out of my shell you know like basically instagram like personally i'm a more of a private person you know so you know, I wouldn't do nothing on there, just to just, uh, like they said, a ghost in there, you know, just, just flick, like, 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 same on Facebook, I used to just do it, um, but suddenly I just come out of shell, I go, right, do you know what, let's do this now, and I am one of people, when I want to do something, I want to do it, you know, good and proper, so I just, like, just went for it, you know, started a, uh, Instagram started following friends and others and started following non you know people I didn't even know just started following they find me put start putting quotes and this and that making you know showing myself and blah blah videos and all that help. then just like got onto YouTube and I thought right you know my son's you know autistic and why don't I talk about that I've, you know I've got the knowledge of it why not you know so I just started you know doing that and all that started making videos and you know. Uh, then um, uh, TikTok, I don't trust me. TikTok, believe me, I'm not interested in that. If I was into, I would have got it from day one. But I was like, what the hell is this? Blah. But I just thought, let's just go for it. You know, let's just do it. You know, all right, what am I gonna do? Singing, dancing, blah, blah, blah kind of stuff. But do you want? Let's do. You know, see what's on there. So I seen dialogues and this. I thought, yeah, man, I might as well do that. And started doing. I just enjoying. Basically, for me, it was a block everything outside the world i were asked no matter what about what people would think of me what people would say i didn't care because you know, that's the only way to beat this depression do not care what others are saying be positive be positive inside you if you're going to be positive you can be anything and everything believe me you can just with anything you know like a football player if he believes him in himself in his talent he can go places yeah and that's what i just thought let's just go and you know alhamdulillah yeah i'm doing good you know i started reading namaz and all that you know here and there and uh, plus uh reading the quran and believe me i bet a lot of you now that was watching this how many of you picked up the quran and started reading it even a page or two you know trust me i used to read like a spar or two but for me thank god ramzan just come up as well so with me it was even better because what i normally do during ramzan is i challenge myself right you know let's read two qurans this year or like last year i think i read like i think three and a half something like that you know so i challenge myself 
uh, and I think that's what you're gonna do challenge yourself be, be brave you know I don't mean oh you're lonely or this I can't do believe me there's plenty of people out there plenty of support there for you it's just about reaching you know it's hard just think of going gym you go gym you go gym and then suddenly you stop going gym how hard is it to get back in the gym you know you'll say yeah i'm gonna go tomorrow tomorrow's a tomorrow tomorrow's always gonna be tomorrow but it's all about that willpower inside you can you do it don't think others are gonna come and do it for you you have to fight yourself you know it's hard but and they no one's gonna come and do it for you you know people are always gonna talk to you because they always say yeah we're always here to talk to you they'll talk to you but when they've gone then you're back to square one aren't you so i think have a positive mind that's what i would say you know and just keep yourself busy do what you gotta do but i said don't do no stupid things you know think stupid this and that yes i know people are probably far off worse than me yeah i'm probably thinking i wish i you know i wish i wish i was dead or i wish i was this i wish i was that but believe me look at me yeah i'm in a wheelchair i can't hardly do anything yeah and i'm happy you know because i fight it you know to get myself where i am because if i didn't i don't know where i would have been i i had to do as much as i could do you know like i said now i'm happy i'm in a happy place because obviously yeah, kids i'm doing my own thing doing my videos doing i'm always keeping myself busy you know look it's within quarantine at the moment yeah you know there's nothing on tv nothing to watch on tv so can you understand how worse it must have come for me but now nah, i'm enjoying my life now all you really need is a holiday trust me <laughs> you know but i'm just gonna say be positive ignore what people are gonna think about you share your problems doesn't matter if there's out of a hundred people one's gonna like take the mickey out of you and laugh at you or your worst enemy is gonna be laughing at you and say yeah save you right but you just gotta remember what goes around comes around today someone's laughing at you tomorrow you'll be laughing at them but do you know what i would say pray read your quran and do good try to do as much good as possible you know believe me you'll be happy please i really hope oh, i really hope yeah that you do watch this video and the people that are in depression believe me there are people worse than you yeah and you can do it believe me you can do it you know there's people out there that will talk to you spend time with you you know just ring your friends i'm sure they can spare a couple of minutes even though you're going to share your problems this and that believe me there's a lot of people out there that will listen there's a lot of people out there just be positive you know smile believe me like they say smile it's sunnah believe me smile be happy you know stay happy make jokes if you obviously not that kind of person with jokes and all that then you know talk to people that are jokers and all that there's plenty of things that you can do but it's all about yourself can you do it can you fight